Welcome back to my channel. It's another car video, um, but as promised, I said I would do an update on my Louis Vuitton Nano Noé and how I'm getting along with that bag uh, and what my thoughts are on that bag. So I would like to show you my very messy car. Yeah, that's how I'm getting along with that bag. That bag is getting sold. <laughs> I can't do it. I just, I can't, it's not working for my life at all whatsoever. In addition, in those four boxes that you just saw, I also have my Nano Speedy, one of the Palm Springs Minis, which I'm a little sad about, but I know it's the right time to sell. And what else is in there? Oh, oh, this is gonna make some people very, very sad. I scored a Nano Speedy in the Stardust collection online on the Louis Vuitton website and it is being returned. Yep, total return. So pretty much half of my Nano bag, I'm just done with Nano bags. That doesn't mean that I don't love small bags because let me show you what I got to replace the Nano Noé the Celine Mini. I'm not even gonna try to pronunciate. I'll write it. I'll, I'll link it down below for you. Um, but the tote, the mini tote, I feel like every single fashion house has a variation of this. Um, but two YouTubers, again, I'll link those down below that I really respect have this particular bag. And I'm kind of on a Celine kick right now. I'm really just into Celine for the moment. So while I can get a good price and my money back in some cases for some of these bags, I'm just switching out. And that's how I play the bag game. I, you know, see something that I really like and then I look in my closet to see what I can part with. And I just decided, the reason I'm selling the original Nano Speedy, because it still does, it's bigger than the Stardust Nano Speedy. But the reason I'm selling that one and it's not fitting my lifestyle as much right now is I got a Speedy 20 in exactly the same print. There's not that much difference between the Nano Speedy and the Speedy 20. Essentially, when you go out, they pretty much look like the same bag. So much so that people have thought it is the same bag. And there's nothing wrong with that. It's just I'd rather free up that money to go to a bag that I'm going to have a, that has a little bit more diversity for my collection. So I'm getting rid of the original Nano Speedy. She's still in really good shape. I'm getting a, a, I'm getting my money back for her. So I've used her this whole time and I've gotten my money back exactly what I paid for her. And I think that that's a really good deal. And the Speedy 20 is fulfilling all of those needs that I have right now as a mom. For example, yesterday we went to a party and it was a kid's birthday party. They had a pinata and the pinata goes, my daughter gathers up all the candy that she can possibly find in her hands. And then she just comes over and she just dumps it in the Speedy 20. Prior to that, a few weeks, we'd had the Nano Speedy and I was at a birthday party and she's handing me things. She handed me an orange. It was like one of those little cutie oranges. And she's like, here, put this in your bag. I'm like, what are they? There's no room. And so I think that that was a really good example and just kind of solidified in my mind that it's okay to get rid of the Nano Speedy. It's okay to get rid of certain bags. The Nano Noé, the new version, I used it about five times throughout a monthly period. And what I noticed is as I carried it, it would start to tip forward. So I would go to pull something out and it would kind of tip forward. Great, there's a car pulling in right next to me. They're gonna think I'm absolutely crazy. That's so awkward. The, the place is completely deserted and this person just pulled in right next to me. Um, awkward, and they backed in so that their driver's side is right next to me so awkward and they're trying to get out it's just so weird okay it's so weird <laughs> it's so awkward moments like you could have parked anywhere anyway 
backed and she backed okay no it's, it's okay um so it's one of those things I don't know what people think when you're making a video in a parking lot but um it was just because it had that handle that was in the front it just tipped forward and then like I said things stuck out at the top which I didn't really have a huge problem with it was just that balancing act of tipping forward and this one really doesn't offer much more room per se but the mini pochette is clearly in there and do I have anything extra in here that I would not have had in the other one I don't this is just all the same stuff that I would have had in the Nano Noe. Oh, uh, wipes. That's something that I can fit in here that I couldn't really fit in the other one. But everything else is pretty much the same. The Nano Speedy, the Stardust version? No, just no. I should have done a what fits. I didn't, I, I really am one of those people that does, I, if I know I'm not gonna keep a bag, I don't wanna play around with the bag. I don't wanna show the bag. I didn't, I got the sense as soon as I got it. I put the, the mini pochette in there and there was just no room for really anything else I'm like this is just no <laughs> no and I and for some people you could take your stuff out of the mini pochette and that's fine if that's you and you can take things out of bags and then put them back in that's great or if you have another little pouch that works for you that's fine but for me that's just not me and I and I'm I'm not gonna mess around with bags that aren't me anymore, just to be trendy. Because I can be trendy in my clothes, I can be trendy with other bags. I have my eye on that mini Jody. that one might work out, but I wanna see it in person. I don't need to have every single it bag just because it's an it bag if it doesn't work for me. I'm too old to play those kinds of games. So I'm not going to. I'm just not going to. This one totally fits the bill. She's cute, she's casual. One of the things that I like about this bag is if I turn her this way, uh, you might not know it's a designer bag unless you're familiar with the Celine logo. So she's a little bit more inconspicuous. She hangs really nicely on my body. She, she fits my frame and I'm really happy with this purchase right here. So. That is my update on the Nano Noe. It's in a box. And literally, I am going to the UPS store. I'm going to Target and I'm going to the UPS store and I'm dropping them off and I'm saying goodbye and I'm making wiser choices from here on out with my bag purchases.